Hey guys, in this tutorial we are going to see how to create a content library. How do you build your library so that we can recycle through it and keep your social accounts populated. So I have already added three different social accounts, a LinkedIn account, a Twitter and a Facebook profile. Now I go to content library, I click on add new library and give it a name. I will call it startups and under this library I want to add content which is relevant to startups so if I wanted to change the name I could change this by changing this here and click on update name if I wanted to add a message or post a link I can type it here it is not easy to be an entrepreneur if you don't have the passion so for instance, this is a quote or this is a message that I want to add to my library. I simply click on add to library and it will show me what it is like. Now if I wanted to add a link, let's grab a link from TechCrunch quickly and then we will post that. Let's see. So I got this link. I will post it here. Simply I'm going to paste the link and uh, Recur post is automatically going to populate everything for me. So I don't want this link here. This is coming here. I can change this if I wanted to. Developing a global financial architecture. Hash TechCrunch. You could do that for Facebook. For Twitter, this is the tweet that is going um, to be used. The text, I mean. So for instance, here is see, uh, here we'll say TechCrunch talks about how to develop a global financial architecture and then I could actually change this image if I wanted to change this image I could change this description so this is what shows up on Facebook in place of title this is what shows up in the description part and this is going to be your message for Twitter this will be your text for your tweet so let me add it to library so here it got added to the library you can always edit it if you want it so it will come back here and you can change it now um, another thing is here is one more button here what it does is sometimes you want to change the ordering of your posts so for instance this one is at top if you want it to appear second then that can happen here so this one became the first one now when it is recycling you can change things let's say um, we pick one more article this one and I will post it here so let's not change anything um, you don't need the message if you don't want it then it will just be posted as the original um, title now you see you can move these around let's say I want this to be first this to be second so I, you could press this this will be first now you could press this and that will be second so easy easy right and then we have shuffle if you wanted to randomly change the ordering then you can click shuffle and it will shuffle things around you see this became second so that's how you create your content library we also have the ability to upload in bulk this is useful when you have hundreds of images that you want to upload or a hundred of tweets text messages that you want to upload in that case you could use upload in bulk but we will save that for another tutorial thank you